online. RC Willie. Welcome back. We're with Dr. John Day. We're talking about sodium in your diet. You know, we're always told, you know, you got to cut back. Cut, cut back. Cut back but, you're, but now the new study says don't cut back too much? Well, it's challenging it. And it was a study of heart failure patients because they're kind of the canary in the coal mines. If anybody's going to get in trouble with too much salt and fluid retention, it's a heart failure patient. Mm -hmm. So 833 people in the study, and they asked them to keep their salt below 2,500 milligrams, which is about What's that? one teaspoon. Okay. And what they found is following these patients for 36 months, those who were on the low sodium diet were 83% more likely to die during the study or be hospitalized. And so it, why is that? We don't fully understand, but it challenges everything we thought we knew about salt. Mm -hmm. Okay, so those of us maybe don't have heart problems, at least right now, right. what do we take away from this? So I think the big picture is, um, it, at least from this study, is that unless you are on a processed or fast food diet, these guys, which mm -hmm. are loaded with salt, unless you're not on one of those, then adding a little bit of salt to your food is probably fine unless your doctor tells you otherwise. Right. Okay. Interesting. Now you can get uh, eating your Pringles, all right? Uh, for more information on this and uh, other health issues, you can go to uh, Dr. Day's website, which is uh, drjohnday.com. As easy as that. Thank you.